Hey everyone, in today's video, I'm gonna show you this social media app called Yik Yak. And this app is new, but it's actually an old app that shut down back in 2017. And just to give you an idea, back in its prime in 2014, it was valued at $400 million. But I wanted to make this quick video to show you the app is very simple, but it's a unique idea to social media. And the idea with the app is that it's completely anonymous social media and it's limited to a five mile range. And if you've ever used Reddit, it's gonna look a lot more familiar to you because it's made like a message board like Reddit. So go ahead and find the Yik Yak app here and let me go ahead and open it up. I've already signed up, but it does require your phone number, but you don't have to create a username or anything. It's completely anonymous here. And once you go through the tutorial process, this is basically the homepage and this app is designed very, very simply. Now, I just got this app, so I'm not really sure if it's gonna be useful for me until I try it for a bit, but I'll just show you around and then you could decide if it's useful or not. But here on the homepage, basically people are posting on here and what you could do as the user of the app is give it an upvote or a downvote, okay? So Reddit works this way too, for example. You could also comment and you could also share anything you see. And there's going to be a whole bunch of them over here under the new tab. Now, this is things that people are posting on this app within five miles of you. So it is limited based on range to you. Now, there's a hot tab too. This shows you everything that is trending. Now, there's these two icons. This one basically just tell you what Yik Yak is. So it's a local message board for your community. Again, within five miles of you and you're anonymous, you could speak your mind. And he says they do have guardrails against bullying and they really focus on privacy here. So hopefully that's the case. And then there's a message board here that shows you notifications. Again, it's really trying to tell you what Yik Yak is and how it works. So if you wanna create your own message here, you just press this pencil icon and this is called a new Yak. So you would type out whatever you wanted here that you wanted your community to know about. And you have a 200 character limit here. So let's say I wanted to promote the movie theater next to me, I'm gonna press ready to send and then swipe to Yak, that's what it's called. And again, it's gonna say, no real names, no hate, all love. I'm gonna go ahead and swipe and it's gonna post it right there to my five mile radius community. And there we go. So now people could go ahead and upvote it, downvote it, share it, or leave their own comments on it. And then there's this other thing here called my yak. So this again, Reddit has a reward system like this, but this is points that you could earn by engaging in the community. This is a way to basically encourage you to engage in the community. And then there's this option right here. This gives you a little bit more about how this all works, community guide rails that you could read about to see how they're protecting that. And you could also see nationwide too. You can't post there, but you could see what's going on nationwide. So I could go to nationwide and I could see what's going on nationwide and see the upvotes for that. And with nationwide, you could still share and comment and upvote here as well. Now, before I give it my usual rating, I wanna spend a little bit more time to see the content, to see if it's useful. I really think for local businesses, for example, it could be great promotional tool, but hopefully it doesn't get very spammy and hopefully the content on it is useful. But if you've used it in the past, I'm sure you're gonna be excited that it's coming back. Thanks so much for watching this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and I'll see you next time.